Hi guys, Mr. Bass. Um, today is going to be the 150 uh, survivor bases. So before I start the base, I just want to prove something. Uh, first of all, my war dogs are level one. So yeah, you don't need high levels or anything like that. You can still do it. Some of mine are. Uh, workshops, but I've literally just put whatever I've got on them. <laughs> right. With 15 dogs, um, I can do three 150s before I need to repair the platoon. And I will show you how. So, first things first, Ruby off, as always. Right. Now, for this, I want to use not that. Right. This one, I've put the um, minus 20% damage from bunkers. Um, you don't need it. Because literally this is the first base I've done with it, but it will help. That one's got the uh, speed bonus. <laughs> right, I just turned Ruby on there as well, by the way. Obviously, you just you just want to send one dog out, take the fire from the flood, and then uh, obviously the rest of them. Ruby controls. Right. Once this lot's gone, and this lot up here, you want to take control of all your dogs, which I just did, obviously double click in there, right, and then you want to control them, and guide them to all the other units. I think I'm taking a little bit more damage on this one than I normally do. For some reason. Right. Now your dogs do obviously tend to uh, go walkies. So if you send them into the middle, they'll generally take most of them out and then obviously you'll just need to click around again, just like that. Right. And bada bing bada boom. One base done. And that was uh, three liberator tokens. Right, so that's how simple that is. Yeah, it did take a bit more damage than uh, usual there. Not sure why, but again, from there you can just find your next one and happy days. Nice and easy. Cheers, guys. Again, let me know uh, what you thought in the comments. Any other bases you want to see, let me know. Cheers.